Boom. Yeah, very good comments from uh, Shalong. Uh, big up, Shalong. Uh, <laughs> very good comment, uh, especially when it comes to uh, great insight. Great insight. To say the cucumber. <laughs> Was a cucumber cucumber break? So you have to admit. That's another comment from Shalong on episode 149 of the True Man Show. You have to admit, we're all, we are all very stupid. They have dumbed down people a hundred percent. I'm struggling with keeping up too. But it's very simple things, but we have created a situation where everything is dramatized. Everything we think about seems to be attached to all of our ego. We don't realize we do it even when it comes to talking. How people, how we react. We all don't like this because our ego is all it is. Is the entire thing. So when conflict arises, we have not the skill or definitions to tackle this. I'm glad Arthur is patient. I would struggle getting this message out. After spending hours with people, they still struggle to get it. Which is none fault. We have to confront these things and well done to Truman because, because to do this live on WWW is not easy on the World Wide Web is not easy it's everything we are it's all fake from kingdom point we don't even realize it and take all this personally there is no way not to confront these things because this is the real truth conflict is not conflict it's essential to make sure we project the community ourselves from the influences of the occultist. Like Arthur said, they will come for you and they do this behind the government. Occultists are the government. This is why the Holy Bible recommend we have governments. Go figure, what else? Are they also have ex exclusive reps? <coughs> Go figure. <coughs> OMG religion <laughs> is very dangerous and was designed as a bridge into our minds for sure. Great insight though. There's not much Arthur and Fiona have not thought about. Kingdom seems to be the only way we move forward. However, I can see it being hijacked by others and used as a political football. I would love to do this on an island. I know if you can do it anywhere, then it will never be done, however. <coughs> an island would enable a little project protection from the outside influences. Or maybe as a start, <coughs> Sorry. Or maybe as a start, you go to the island kingdom to learn to rethink or forget without pressures of the outside world. Once mastered, then we could move inland. Just an idea. Religion is a worry. Non believers in Jesus and Allah are always killed over history. If we are to believe the stories we hear from the Jesuit, is story anyway excellent deconstruct of the person making claims about Arthur being angry fantastic to hear made my ear brilliant assessment of how people can't even see that it's them projecting their BS onto Arthur this is done time after time I hear this kind of thing all the time now I have the reason why it's done and why that. Next comment, another one. Could you start a love for life dating site community? 
Once connected to our destine partner, we remove data, cables, inculcation, etc. Please, so we can all have a similar goal in our par partners prior to wasting years only to realize we were blinded due to the lack of option comparability. I'm here slaving in the matrix because I'm looking for the ideal companion. However, the matrix has been has pre programmed people into the I am complex, which is very unattractive to me. However, they, the 99.9% .9 occultist brainwashed by the system, and would not be into this truth and could not act the reality of true responsibility. As stupid as it sounds, I feel like we can, we all can put up with partners who are not compatible with because the choices are limited. As a Euro person, I'm struggling to even find a fellow partner given the current migration policy. In the city, let alone then finding a partner who wants kingdom. I feel there's a middleman, government, invisible end that taken control of people does divide us all through indoctrination, addiction, spells, peace. Big up Shalong, big up Shalong. Here's another one. Maybe I'll come back uh, with the uh, with the next one. I'll be back. <laughs>